हेलो नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज क्लब्स गार्डन कोएफिशिएंट फॉर जे इज इक्वल टू 1/2 एंड जेड इज इक्वल टू 1/2 So in angular momentum series, this is the next topic. Topic name is PG coefficient for PG means Clubs uh, Garden. J1 is equal to 1 divided by 2, J2 equal to 1 divided by 2. So therefore, we need to find the CG coefficient of uh, J1 is equal to 1 and J2 is equal to 1. So for given problem there, uh, J1 is equal to 1 divided by 2 and J2 is equal to 1 divided by. Therefore, here I am going to write M1, which is corresponding M1 and M2. Both can be taken. The values. Uh, one is plus one by two, another one is and minus one divided. For example, if you put j is equal to one, what is n where j is equal to one divided by two? So m one value can vary from minus j to plus j right? The quantization rules. So therefore, uh, in case J1 is equal to 1 by 2 if M1 value plus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2. So J2 is all equal to 1 divided by 2, right? Get same. That is 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2. So therefore, eventually, got the four functions. Uh, those are the i. So here I'm going to denote quantum state like this. In, uh, Psi wave function psi m1 comma m2. Okay, this is one quantum state. And other quantum state I am going to generate here. The very important one. Uh, j i j comma m. So if you want to em, you need to add uh, m1 plus m2, then only you can get m. So these are the quantum states. Then I'm going to find these uh, functions. What is uh, psi m1 m2 value? What is i j m values? Okay. So for that, I need to check the first uh, what are the corresponding values of the j is equal to. <coughs> In case if you take uh, j values from so this addition of angular momentum uh, j equal to how we can get j value j equal to we can get j1 plus j right j1 plus j2 so therefore j this j can take the values from j1 plus j2 
modulus of j1 minus j2 is j1 so then only we can get this j values right so please try to substitute j1 and j2 value here this one divided by two and here one divided by two plus one two then modulus right modulus one divided by two minus one divided by two so this is one and and uh, zero this is zero so i got here the two uh, two j values so please uh, listen carefully so that means j can take in here j can we must j can take only one and zero only okay then only you can find the i j comma uh, m value right so for that we need to find this uh, m1 and m2. so what is uh, m1 and m2 so m value we can get m1 plus m2 right so if we try to add this m1 and m2 Then you can get easily yeah. so if you add m1 and m2 here also so first you can take the values m value for example in case if i use j is equal to one J equal to one here, okay. Then I can get uh, M values one zero minus one, right? Because if you take J is equal to one, then what is M value? M value is equal to plus or minus J, right? So in between plus or minus J, zero also there. Next, if we take j is equal to 0, then these corresponding m values to 0. So these are the functions. So, therefore, we can form the four functions, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, right? You understand? See here wave function pi <coughs> pi if you take j is equal to j equal to one first okay j equal to one because pi j m wave function that is an initial quantum state of the system of the and pi j m state right so therefore in case if I take j is equal to 1 here, then the corresponding m value that is 1 is there, okay. And uh, again, the pi j is equal to 1, and this is over, and uh, m equal to 0. Next. I j is equal to one m minus one. Next final value pi j is equal to zero m is equal to zero. So these are the four corresponding functions I got. So by using this I quantum state, pi of j m quantum state and uh, one more four quantum states are there the given problem they are already given oh j is equal to one and two so here we didn't design this quantum state right so no problem 
can design this quantum state m1 and m2 only, right so m1 and m2 so we can get four quantum states here by 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2 comma pi 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2 comma pi minus 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2 pi 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2 so sorry for that i didn't uh, design this four functions initially it is hard to there okay because they are already given j is equal to j1 is equal to 1 divided by j2 is equal to 2. Then you can easily find out the how many corresponding values you can get, right? So in case if you put j is equal to 2j plus 1, one value, you can add. So how I got this four function? Um, for example, 2j1 plus 1, if you take this value, substitute j1 is equal to 1 by divided by 2, then you can get two values. Then if you try to substitute j, uh, Two is equal to one divided by two j2 then you can get two wells total how many functions are there four functions these are the four functions in the similar manner here also you can get four functions if you try to put a j is equal to one divided by two so this is how we get the uh, i and i corresponding quantum state value then you can try to write this equation so this is the equation right i generally i am going to write this one j comma m right so this is uh, these are the corresponding values some con some constant is there here okay constant and the wave function i uh, this is m1 and m2 in case if you try to add m1 and m2 you can get so once you know the m values i mean j value are already there right then you can get easily this function you need to write according to this general equation you need to arrange these functions so first here i'm going to arrange very simple thing uh, pi i one one state one one state so wave function psi 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2 so you need to check this one m1 right this is m2 you add m1 and m2 plus you can get the m value okay so this j value already there here j is j is equal to 1 0 so these are already designed okay next function this is the only combination you can get this m one value here next one I one and minus one quantum state will get by using this combination of wave function psi minus one by two comma minus one divided by two. So for the remaining vectors, so remaining vectors uh, another vector is there okay. one zero. So you need to write this uh, linear combination because we can't get by adding simply m1 and m2. So here I'm going to use this uh, a1 wave function psi and 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2 <coughs> plus a2 wave function psi. Okay, these are two possibilities are there, right? You get Zero. These are the two possibilities. Yes, if we try to add this m1 and n2, then you can get here also one more state is the twofold degeneracy. Right? Next. So for example, zero state and one more state. One is England state. Uh, it is also possible two combination one divided by two 
minus 1 divided by plus a4 wave function psi minus 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2. So I am going to giving this equation number 1 say this is equation number 1, this is equation number 2, <coughs> this is equation number 3, this is equation number 4. Okay, the, what is the coefficient here? 1. No need to calculate it. Here also coefficient is 1. So now I am going to find what is a1, a2, a3, and a4 with the CG coefficients of a1 is equal to 1 divided by 2, a2 is equal to 1 divided by 2 values. So for that, uh, first I am going to apply <coughs> uh, j minus j minus j minus operator on this corresponding quantum state 1 comma 1 state. Okay, so uh, you already know right this one. J, J, this is M. So this is minus state. It will decrease by one state. So therefore, I'm going to write this one like this. J, M minus one. Because here I'm applying J minus operator. This is operator. This is quantum state. So if you apply uh, any operator on quantum state uh, or wave function can change into the another type of function and multiply by some constant. Well, these are the constant values, which means uh, j minus uh, eigen values. These are the j minus eigen values. If you want to know how this j minus eigen values get quantum series are there, you can go and then look at quantum series previous class. So these are the corresponding uh, eigenvalues of this operator. Okay. So this is eigenvalue, this is eigenfunction of the term. So in case if we try to uh, find these values here, we can find j is equal to 1 after that. So what is j value? 1. What is m value? 1. So after substituting this uh, values j minus j minus is a function side okay root of 1 into 1 plus 1 minus 1 1 minus 1 a function side here also 1 this is 1 minus 1 J minus pi 1 comma 1 equal to root 2. Wave function pi 1 comma 0. So first I want this quantum state. You need to find this quantum state, right? So this I want. This is equation number 3. Yes, if you try to observe. See here. This is equation number 3. Okay. For that, I am going to changing this equation like this, pi 1 comma 0 equal to, now this is going the other side, 1 divided by root 2. The remaining portion is j minus pi 1 comma 1. So this is already known. Uh, this equation, this equation, this equation, uh, 1 comma 1, right, in equation number 1, so equation number 1, wave function psi, 1 comma 1, equation number 1, this is the equation number 1. So in place of pi 1 comma 1 state, I am going to use this psi 1 by 2, 1 by 2 state. Then only I can get the coefficients. Oh, 1 divided by root 2. J minus, please observe carefully here, this is wave function psi 
1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2 so this is m1 and this is m2 then you can split this uh, j minus into the two operators j1 minus plus j2 plus okay this one so that equal to 1 divided by root 2 so 1 divided by root 2 is there one for cut this one and uh, j1 minus plus j2 minus okay so this the function psi 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2 so 1 divided by root 2 j1 minus I'm going to apply on this quantum state 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2 second one is j2 minus okay, minus and uh, the quantum state 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2. so this is m1 this is m2 this is m1 huh? so what is j minus eigenvalue 1 divided by root 2 if you apply this quantum state on this wave function and you can get decrease one state only okay so first i am going to write this function after applying j1 minus it means m1 state is decreased by one unit so wave function psi 1 divided by 2 minus 1 comma 1 divided by 2 this corresponding eigen values are these are the eigen values so you can write j1 j1 plus 1 m1 m1 minus 1 these are the corresponding eigen values okay so please recognize here h cross i'm going to use what eigen values so in the similar manner here also you can if you apply j2 plus then you can get corresponding eigen values j2 into j2 plus 1 minus m2 m2 plus 1 wave function psi here j2 minus right m2 is decreased by 1 step 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2 minus 1 okay now this equation is complete then you can try to apply this j1 m1 so j1 is equal to always 1 divided by 2 i mean please stop because they are given j1 is equal to 1 divided by 2 j2 is equal to 2, right then what are the corresponding m1 value m2 m1 value what is m1 value here m1 value is m1 value is 1 divided by 2 and uh, here j2 j2 equal to 1 divided by 2 what is m2 1 divided by 2 so after substituting these values 1 divided by root 2 okay the root of root of 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2, 1 minus 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2 minus 1 sorry so this is minus 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2 plus root of 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2 plus 1 minus 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2 sorry 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 minus J minus operator, right? This is minus. Okay. Uh, minus one. Wave function psi. One divided by two minus one divided by two. Okay. 
In case if we try to simplify this thing, then you can get one right. One divided by root two. This is root one wave function size. One divided by two comma. One divided by two. Plus this is root one. Then wave function size and divided by two minus one divided by two. So therefore the equation one divided by root two wave function psi minus one divided by two one divided by two plus one divided by root two wave function psi one divided by two so i one comma zero we got the answer right. Let us go and compare the general wave function and this corresponding wave function. Okay. Um, maybe this is I'm going to give the for oh five. Equation number five. So if you try to compare equation number five and equation number three, so a one and a two, a one and a two, a one equal to one divided by root two, comma a two is equal to one divided by two. Okay. <coughs> Next, I want A3 for A3 and uh, A4. We need A3 and A4, okay? So I'm going to use this uh, orthogonal condition. From orthogonal condition. Equation number uh, five and equation number four. So equation number five is um, wave function pi one comma zero, and equation number four is zero comma zero. Orthogonal, right? orthogonal condition is equal to zero orthonormal is one so in case if you try to multiply these three things then you can get so this is first thing I'm going to write this one value one divided by root two okay wave function psi one divided by two minus one divided by two less one divided by root two the wave function psi minus one divided by two comma 1 divided by 2. So this is the uh, wave function psi 1 comma 0. Then pi 0 0 value is a3 wave function psi 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2 plus a4 minus 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by Equal to, if you try to multiply this in the product, then we can get only the a3 and a4 the same state. Okay, this state and this state the remaining all conditions are zero, right? Same state you can get uh, normalization condition, then you can get one other state becomes to the zero. Therefore, I hope you understand this uh, notation, right? Okay, a3 root 2 plus a4 1 divided by root 0 remaining all states are 0 so from this uh, equation i can write a3 a3 equal to minus a4 
Now I'm going to use ortho normal condition. Okay. So wave function psi zero zero same state. Then only I can get a A three and A four value this equal to one. So this is orthogonal and orthogonal. Simply here I am going to apply this orthonormal condition. So orthogonal and orthonormal both condition we need to apply. So therefore, I am going to multiply this wave function 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2. Therefore, wave function psi minus 1 divided by 2 comma 1 divided by 2 into a3 wave function psi 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2 plus a4 wave function psi minus 1 divided by 2 1 divided by 2 equal to 1. So if you try to multiply this thing then you can get a3 square plus a4 square equal to 1. So I'm going to substitute a3 equal to minus a4 right. So a3 square plus a3 square equal to 1 then a3 square equal to 1. a3 equal to a3 square equal to 1 divided by 2. Then a3 equal to 1 divided by root 2. Similarly a4 equal to minus 1 divided by 2. Therefore, eigenvalues, I mean, is the equation of uh, functions are from equation number 1, 2, 3, and 4. So, I am going to write these things. Wave function psi 1, comma 1 equal to wave function psi, psi 1 divided by 2, comma 1 divided by 2. This is the equation number 1. Psi 1, 0 equal to 1 divided by root 2 is the order 1 divided by 2 minus 1 divided by 2 plus 1 divided by root 2 wave function psi minus 1 divided by 2 divided by 2 next 0 0 equal to So next class I'm going to discuss is J but this is minus J1 is equal to 1 and J2 is equal to 1 divided by 2. That is quite complicated compared to this one. This is easiest thing. In case if you want to solve this type of problems, then you need to First, practice uh, the Hagen values and Hagen functions of uh, angular momentum matrix and get easily. So, these are the Hagen values and Hagen functions. Generally, we can uh, write these things in matrix form. So, this is a matrix form. So, very important thing. Matrix form phi one comma one equal to so matrix form right phi phi these are the equation form matrix transformation. I'm going to so how to write this matrix transformation one comma minus one. This is matrix. Okay. Then this corresponding CG coefficients are this 1, 0, 0, 0, this is 0, 1 divided by root 2, 1 divided by root 2, 0, 0, 1 divided by root 2, minus 1 divided by root 2, 0, 
zero 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 one. A function size one divided by two one. A function size one divided by two minus one divided by two. A function size minus one divided by two divided by two. A function size both are minus one divided. So here these functions, bracket functions are there, right? These are the CG coefficients. CG coefficient. So next class I'm going to discuss uh, j is equal to 1 and j is equal to 1 divided by 2. That's one in CG coefficient. Okay.